Justin Guarini. He had millions of fans and a bright future after finishing second in the very first season of American Idol. But as the spotlight faded, the former heartthrob admits he has experienced his share of hard times. ABC's Nick Watt has his story. There are hills and mountains between us. More than 20 million Americans watched Justin Guarini duke it out with Kelly Clarkson in the first ever American Idol final back in 2002. Kelly Clarkson. Clarkson took the crown and is now a megastar. Three Grammys, 20 million in record sales. And Justin Guarini. In an extraordinary new blog post, he confesses, I have spent days skipping meals in order to make sure I have enough, to make sure my children and my wife have enough. What? This is a guy who shared top billing with Clarkson in a movie, from Justin to Kelly. Friends of yours? No, not exactly. Um, look, I need to get out of here. Fast forward a decade and he says there's not a tweeny fan in sight. It's very rare for a celebrity to admit that He's in pain. He's not as successful as people imagine. Fame and riches do not necessarily go hand in hand. Now a married father of two, Guarini writes, there was a time when I could have thrown down cash for a house. Now I rent a home filled with love. Reality show fame can be fleeting. Anna Nardona vanquished Justin Timberlake on Star Search in 92 and has since worked in a preschool and a day spa. Timberlake, he's got plenty of money to buy suits and ties. As for Guarini, now an aspiring actor, it's not all bad news. He's about to play a supporting role in Romeo and Juliet on Broadway, alongside Orlando Bloom. On his blog, Guarini says he only triggers dim memories for fans. Maybe not anymore. His blog got so much attention, apparently, his website crashed. For Good Morning America, Nick Watt, ABC News, Los Angeles.